Rumor has it you went on a date with Court Reynolds. I hear he's very nice. He's all right. He kept talking about this bulimic head case. Really? Bulimic head case? Yeah. Anywho, Court's invited me to the Hamptons for Labor Day weekend. That's great. You think so? I don't know. I guess I'm just scared. Of what? Duh. Of boys. I've never even been to first base with a guy. Haven't you ever practiced on one of your girlfriends? No. No. That's gross. It's not gross. How else do you think girls learn? Okay. Face me. Now close your eyes and wet your lips. Are you for real? You want to learn or not? I guess. <sighs> See, that wasn't so scary. It was nothing. Okay. Let's try it again. Only this time, I'm gonna stick my tongue in your mouth. And when I do that, I want you to massage my tongue with yours. And that's what first base is. Okay. Eyes closed. Oh, that was straight. Maybe you should try it on your friend Ronald sometime. What are you saying? Oh, come on, Cecile. It's so obvious he's crazy about you. <laughs> he sends me love letters, you know. That's so romantic. Have you responded? Well, don't you like him? I do like him. I think about him all the time. I don't know what to do. If my mother found out, she would kill me. You did hide the letters, right? In an antique dollhouse in my room. I want you to make copies of the letters and bring them to me. Why? Because if there's one thing I'm great at, it's love letters. With my help, Ronald will be eating out of the palm of your hand. Mm, perhaps we could also arrange a little get together with the two of you at my place. You do that for me? Poor silly, we're friends, right? Best friends. You want to have a sleepover? No, Cecile, I'm not up for another night in a row of watching musicals, listening to Barbara and Judy, and helping you wax your back crack and sack. It's not even what I was going to say. Just wanted to hang out, do something tough, watch Buffy reruns, Red Hellboy. 